Massimo, did we have any mail? No, oh. but your neighbor gave this to me. Oh, I wonder if it's from Phil. <laughs> Oh no, it's an invitation to Cassidy's birthday party. My kids will be very excited, Osmo. Awesome. Thank you, that was great. Well, I'm an amazingly capable humanoid robot. Yes. How can I help you? Well, actually, my parents are coming over later because my wife and I... Oh my gosh, I completely forgot. I was supposed to call my wife as soon as you got here. I was just having so much fun with the neighbors that... I... You know what? We should probably give her a call right now. Come on. I better run speed dial. Hi. Hey, look, we just arrived. Awesome. Yeah. Can I keep it? <laughs> sure. Hello. Hi, Awesome. I'm leaving work early today. Okay. And I'll pick up the kids. They are so excited. I know. So I'll see you in a while. Oh, and honey, don't forget we're going out tonight. So remind your parents that they're babysitting and order pizza. Oh, yeah. yeah Thanks. Yeah. Mm -hmm. See you. Bye, honey. Bye. Bye, Awesome. Goodbye. <laughs> She's so cute. Well, Osmo, welcome to the family. Thank you. I just need to remember to order that pizza. What do you think? Sausage or pepperoni? What am I talking about? Now, developing the world's most advanced humanoid robot didn't happen overnight. It took teams of Honda experts over 20 years to create this amazing piece of technology. And we're talking about experts in the fields of physics, anatomy, mathematics, computer sciences, chemistry, mechanical, and electrical engineering. Oh, and check this out. Awesome? Come this way, please. Now, if I'm sitting down, or in a wheelchair like my wife, Osimo's camera eyes are at about the same level as my eyes, and this makes communication very simple. In fact, if you look over at the screen, you can see Osimo looking at me. Hello, Osimo. Hello, Kevin. Oh, Osimo, please turn out to all of our new friends. And everyone, wave and say, hello, Osimo. Hello, everybody. And there you are. Now, you might be wondering why Osmo isn't on wheels or treads or something like that. Well, Osmo is designed to help people and to be a helper in our world, a world where we need to reach for things and pick things up or navigate along floors and sidewalks, even just to climb a set of stairs. What better design than that of a humanoid robot? One that has two arms and two legs. And Osmo, how tall are you? I'm four feet and three inches tall. Which is the perfect height for opening and closing doors or turning lights on and off, even working at table surfaces, or just moving things around the inside of the house. And Osimo, how much do you weigh? I weigh 119 pounds. And I wonder what all that would be in metric. One. I'm 130 centimeters tall and weigh 54 kilograms. All right. And how fast can you walk? I can walk about two miles per hour. And in metric, that would be about... That would be about three kilometers per hour. Yeah, that's great, Osimo. Thank you, Kevin. Now, in order for a robot to operate in our world, it must have the ability to walk. And walking can be very complicated. See if you can follow me on this. You see, with each step that I take, my brain must send countless signals at lightning-fast speed throughout my nervous system. You know, these signals must travel to... travel to the muscles, tendons, and ligaments in my legs, hips, arms, and shoulders, which all have to move in sync just for me to keep my balance. But the really amazing thing... <laughs> The really amazing thing is that Osmo does something very similar to this, but uses motor sensors and computers to keep its balance and walk like a human. Now, Osmo can also sidestep in a straight line or on a curve, and this makes navigating <laughs> navigating through a house with all of its constantly changing obstacles very simple. And believe me, Osmo, that move is going to come in very handy with my kids and all of their constantly changing obstacles. But, what's even more impressive, not only can Osimo walk forward, but Osimo can also walk backward as well. 
constantly adjusting its center of gravity with each step. <laughs> Just like us. And Osmo's balance is so good, you know what? Let's just show them. Osmo, please balance on one foot, um, like this. Yeah. Now Osmo makes it look easy. How about the other foot? All right. But Osmo must constantly analyze the data from all of its sensors and 34 separate servo motors. And well, Osmo, I guess it's true. There's really nothing you can't do except fly. Right? But I can play soccer. Yes, you can. And you know, I think Molly left her soccer ball here. Yeah. So, why not show everyone? Oh, hold on just a moment. Let me get some goalposts so we can make it official. All right, Osmo. Bend it by Beckham. <laughs> oh, and that's a goal. Yes. Now, it looks simple, but kicking the soccer ball actually requires some technically advanced balance stability and coordination. But you know, Osimo, with your ability to understand vocal commands and navigate effortlessly through the environment, it's easy to see how helpful you're going to be around the house. Oh, telephone. Hey, Osimo. Okay. Hey. Hey, is Osimo there? Yeah, right here. Hello. That is so cool. Uh, Osimo, no. we'll be home in like five minutes. <laughs> Everyone in the neighborhood. Now, Osmo, you're a star. Bye, Osmo. Bye, Osmo. Okay, bye, kids. Bye now. How about a bye, Dad? Bye, love you. You're cool. Well, Osmo looks like you're pretty popular with my kids. Oh, come on. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Actually, what my kids were talking about is Osmo's DVD, Step to Safety with Osmo in which it shows how we can use Osmo's unique walking ability to help teach young children safe ways of crossing the street. But Osmo can be helpful in many different ways. In fact, Osmo, could you use your wireless networking capabilities to go online and look for tonight's weather forecast? Yes, I will go online. Great. My wife and I are going out for our anniversary. Partly cloudy, with a high in the mid-60s. Perfect. I'll just remind her to bring a sweater we can have dinner on the patio. Now, even though Osmo's current role is to help her in the home today, someday Osmo might be able to work in dangerous situations, like fighting fires. <laughs> yeah. Or work in unhealthy environments, cleaning up toxic spills. And there's even the possibility... But I'm not only designed to help. I can also have fun. I think I know what you're talking about. Everyone, would you like to see Osmo dance? Yeah? <laughs> okay. How about this, Osmo? You lead, I'll try to follow. Go ahead and kick it. Upstairs and look into the room on the right to see if it's ready for my parents? Of course. Right. 
Now, what you're about to see is one of Osmo's most challenging maneuvers, made possible by combining all of its onboard technology. The ability to climb a set of stairs with balance and precision is a culmination of over two decades of research and development. Now, first, Osmo stops momentarily at the foot of the stairs and adjusts its position by reading a mark on the floor using a sensor in its torso. Oh, are you all ready, Osmo? I am ready. <laughs> okay, then. Go for it. Now, with each step, Osmo must adapt and constantly counterbalance using all its computing power to remain upright all along the way. Way to go, Osmo! <laughs> Go ahead and take a look into the room and see if it's ready for my mom and dad, please. And, well, that looks perfect. Thank you, Osimo. You're welcome. Now, if you thought going up the stairs was difficult, it takes even more balance and coordination to make it back down. Whenever you're ready, Osimo. And once again, Osimo will find its position by reading a mark on the floor using the sensor in its torso. And, when it's ready, it will descend the stairs, constantly adjusting with each step. Actually, run. Yeah. Okay, awesome. Oh, then it looks like Osmo's getting warmed up, which is something we all need to do before any physical activity. I mean, no one wants to get a cramp in a servo motor. <laughs> now, in order for Osmo to run, both of its feet must leave the ground at the same time, if only for a moment. And Osmo is the only life sized humanoid robot in the world that can accomplish this moving at speeds of nearly four miles per hour, or in metric, six kilometers per hour. Okay, Osmo, let me know when you're all warmed up and ready. I am ready. All right, on your mark, get set. similar to that of a human. Very impressive, Osimo. Thank you, Kevin. Now, if you'd like to learn more about Osimo, please visit the website at osimo.honda.com. As for you, I think it's time we get you ready to meet the rest of the family. So, why don't we say goodbye to all of us? Excuse me. Oh, yes? Please do not forget to order the pizza. Pizza? That's right. Thank you, Osimo. You're welcome. You know what, Osimo? I think this is going to be the beginning of a beautiful friendship. All right. <laughs> anyway. Hi, oh, the kids are home. I hope you're ready to meet them. But before we go, let's say goodbye to all of our new friends. Goodbye, everybody. And everyone, let's hear one more time for Osimo.